Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel, welcome back to uh, my channel for some of you guys, hope you guys are doing well. Um, so this is your general love reading for August, feel free to jump ahead to the start of the reading guys, it is time stamped, so if you click in the description bar below, see where it says start reading, click on that and that will bring you to the uh, start of the reading. This section is really for those that just kind of prefer to see me shuffle on camera. So I'm going to take a look and see who's showing up in your reading. See what they're thinking and feeling regarding yourself and of course, vice versa as well. I will clarify these cards off camera guys, just so I'm not, you know, you guys are not sitting through. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to take these in, clarify them off camera and I'll be back. So Capricorn, let's start your reading. And of course, take whatever side resonates with you guys and picking up as uh, this being your side, the person you're dealing with over here, but you can always flip switch whatever side just kind of resonates the most. All right, so currently you're kind of in this hermit type of space, Capricorn. Um, this could be, for some of you, this could be you just spending a lot of time alone, trying to process this situation, digest it. You know, I was going to say ask yourself those important questions, but I feel like you've already done that. This is more about just processing, um, going through thoughts within your mind about just future, uh, what you're stepping away from. This could also be you still being around people, but you, this is more of an internal uh, process for you or experience for you because there is this disappointment around this situation with this person. Um, but you're not wanting to acknowledge it. You're not wanting to deal with those feelings or thoughts. It's like, I just don't want to deal with that. I don't want to deal with that. I don't want to acknowledge them. I feel like that's more so, <clears throat> I do apologize. I feel like this is more so coming from the fact that you've had to do that in the past, maybe several times. And it's like, enough's enough. I don't really want to deal with that anymore. I've made my decision. Um, there's disappointment there. And I just want to kind of focus on this new opportunity that you're wanting, this new chapter or this new future or future vision that you have for yourself. I don't feel like a lot of you have heard from this person because this person is showing up as a three, which is more about them waiting. It's this waiting element. Hence why I feel like for a lot of you, you've not heard. If, you've, if there's a silent period, if you've not heard a peek out of this person, it doesn't mean that they've gone doesn't mean that they're not thinking about you. They're, they're really just in this waiting um, place, waiting for the right time to act um, and to do something because, because there is this idea that they do have with that ace. <laughs> Let me show you that. That ace of swords there. Some form of idea, ideas, this bright idea that they have, um, keeping it to themselves, not sharing that. But the intention is to, it's like they feel like, okay, this is going to, move them forward to to in some form of positive way but their intention is to overcome any battle or come out on top when it comes to this so if you haven't heard from them uh, which i feel like a lot of you haven't there's a quiet period uh, they're not gone let's say that very much still committed to this because in the past you made a decision about this about ending this relationship this is this is someone that you've been with for a while, that's been in your life for a while, maybe childhood sweethearts for a lot of you. Um, but it's like if you, you felt like you had to end it in order for you to generate some form of change, change in your life, change when it comes to just you and yourself and what it is that you want. I don't feel like for a lot of you it had much to do with maybe what this person has done, but maybe more about how much you've grown and changed. Because this speaks... There's a heavy energy around you coming into more of an alignment with what it is that you want. You've got that temperance card. That temperance card there. And, and being adamant about that as well. Yes, there's a lack of clarity with the moon about not knowing how maybe the process is going to unfold or how things are going to unfold for you. But there's still adamancy there. It's like I'm adamant about making this change. I'm adamant about the decision that I've made. I'm adamant about what it is that I'm, I'm wanting. Where with your person, they were still very much 
in that king of cups energy you know this loyalty towards you um yes yeah, stability again i feel like for a lot of you this is a relationship that has been that has been around for a while around for a while but with the decision that you made it kind of made this person start to think that oh you know is there someone else involved with that three of cups there is there someone else involved you know there's still attraction there that they have towards you and they feel like they've tried it's like i've tried to maybe turn this around try to you know make this make this um yeah turn this around ultimately with that seven but it's not amounted to much of anything still very much drawn towards you and not wanting to lose you as well because there is this recognition with that sun card that you have brought and still continue to bring some form of positive element uh, into their life in some way so there's definitely disappointment around this for them but they're willing to take a risk hence which brings us to where we are at the moment this silent period you know this bright idea that they do have um for you it's like this has come crashing down and i'm more about embracing this opportunity to build something new to establish something new you know to create something new yes it's going to take some time yes there's going to be maybe a waiting period but i'm 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 more about embracing that this is more aligned with what it is that i want for myself and my future where with your person they're more about okay so i'm going to give give my capricorn a bit of time I'm going to give them some time to um you know i'm going to take my foot off the gas that's what's coming up for me i'm going to take my foot off the gas i'm going to allow this situation to just kind of bubble down simmer down a little bit and then i'm going to come in with this whatever it is this bright idea that this person has because they're very much for them it's for them they're not finished for them they're not finished i'm not sure how many of you actually get comfort from that idea of them not being finished i don't think a lot of you are if i'm honest with you to apologize cross watcher but you know capricorn just in a space where they're growing up i feel like this is someone that you've been with for a, a while whether it's a long marriage whether it's childhood sweethearts and you change you grow and you change and you evolve and your needs change and your wants change especially if you've met someone at a young age and this is all you've known or that's all they've known you both change and grow and grow and i feel like that's what's happening for you you're changing you're growing and what no longer serves you um or what no longer rewind priscilla what once you know fulfilled you um no longer serves you at this stage um and you're recognizing that in fact you're being honest with yourself about that where with your person they're like uh-uh no no you know no I, i'm still very much committed to this but very i still very, feel very much committed to you i still have this you know drive to continue to, to to you know i feel in alignment with you this is this is you know they haven't they haven't expanded out of this relationship you kind of know how they feel they are thinking that you do have your guards up though you are very much guarded hence them waiting you know their intention is to come out on top when it comes to this ultimately get this back ultimately get this back not sure how successful that they're going to be in doing that the, cha the the challenge really is 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 at what point is this person going to realize um that you are you know genuinely moving on at what point and and if and and, and if when they realize that where does that how does that turn how does this have an impact on on them and what they do next so let's move into the extended version of the reading link is in the description bar below guys and i shall see you guys in a bit